Hi, I'm Dr. Josh Axe and welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to be making sweet potato fries, which is one of my favorite recipes. And sweet potatoes are great for many reasons, but one is they're packed with vitamins and minerals. And actually this orange color you see in the sweet potato means that it's full of a, a, uh, actually a phytonutrient called beta carotene, which actually helps, uh, helps your body in anti-aging helps your body in, in fighting off free radical damage. So what we're going to do is start off making the sweet potato fries. So first thing you're going to do with the sweet potato fries is you're going to take the sweet potato and you're going to just kind of cut off the ends here. And then you're going to take the sweet potato and you're going to cut it right in half, like so. Okay. From there, you're going to cut them one more time right down the middle, like so. Place them on the ends. We'll do the same thing with the other half cutting it in half, and then now we're going to start cutting them into fry, fry size um, little pieces. And so you're going to take the sweet potatoes here, start cutting them like this, okay. And you can see, so that's about the size of a fry. This one here though we're going to cut a little bit smaller. And again it's all up to you. Some people actually like potato wedges, so you're fine making them into wedges. A lot of people like their fries a little bit thinner, and so that choice is up to you there on how thick you'd like to make the sweet potato fries. Now that the sweet potatoes are all chopped up and we have them in these fry-like pieces, we're going to go ahead and start seasoning the sweet potatoes. But before I do that, I want to talk about some of the other ingredients and also talk about some of the nutritional be ben benefits of doing the sweet potato fries. So first off, like I said earlier, sweet potatoes are full of beta carotene and vitamin A, which is actually helping your body fight off free radical damage, helps your body in anti-aging, helps fight heart disease, cancer, you name it. Beta carotene helps you do it. Also, it's very high in vitamin B6, which your body needs from energy. Just from one serving of sweet potatoes, you'll get about 30% your actually daily intake needed of vitamin B6, and also very high in fiber. Every sweet potato has about seven grams of fiber, and you should be getting anywhere from about 30 to 40 grams of fiber a day. And so what we're gonna do now is start seasoning these sweet potatoes. And a few of the ingredients we're gonna use, one is paprika. Paprika is actually also full of antioxidant, which gives it its red color. Also, we're going to do sea salt. We're going to use Celtic sea salt because it's full of more vitamins, minerals, and, and uh, trace minerals. Specifically, it has magnesium, potassium, chloride in there. And also, we're going to use, use cinnamon, which is one of my personal favorite spices because it helps balance out blood sugar levels, helps with diabetes, helps with energy level, and it's also one of the top two antioxidants on the planet. And so what we're going to do now is start seasoning the sweet potato fries. So what we'll do is you'll see here we have a bag already chopped up of these sweet potatoes. And basically what we'll do is start taking um, some sea salt and just kind of dumping that in the bag here. Okay. Sprinkle it in. All right. Next thing we're going to start adding in is the paprika. Some more thing you're just going to kind of douse these sweet potatoes in there. And once you get them in the pan, you can also throw in a little bit more if you think it needs more. There we go. And last thing is the cinnamon, which gives it a sweeter taste, which I love throwing the cinnamon in there. So we'll throw cinnamon all over these sweet potatoes. There we go. Now what we're going to do is go ahead and add some oil to the sweet potatoes to kind of give them more of that moist, uh, moist taste and help them cook better. And what we typically are going to use is grapeseed oil or coconut oil. And you can also use organic butter. And so you can, you can if you need to, uh, which most of the time you will, with coconut oil, it's actually a harder texture. And so is butter, so you'll need to melt those before you put those on the sweet potato fries. But with grapeseed oil, and you can pick this up at any grocery store, it's actually going to be in liquid, and so you can actually just pour it in a cup. And we're going to use about a fourth a cup of oil. And again, I typically use grapeseed oil or coconut oil. And the other great thing about these type of oils, like I said, like the grapeseed or the coconut, is they don't oxidize under heat. That's one of the dangers of using olive oil. If the temperature gets too high, it will oxidize and actually become a bad fat. So we're going to take this fourth a cup of oil here, kind of pour that into the bag here. And the next thing we're going to do is take the bag and we're going to seal it. And then we're going to mix it up. And so we're just going to take the sweet potatoes here, move them around in the bag with your hands like this. Just kind of get all the sea salt, the cinnamon, the paprika, and the oil all mixed up together. It doesn't have to take too long. Just kind of mix it around here for about 30 seconds. And 
they're good to go. And so what you're gonna do next is we're gonna open this bag and we're gonna put the sweet potato fries right in a glass bowl. You, you, and you don't have to use glass, you could also use um, stainless steel or some sort of metal, metal container. But we're gonna take these sweet potato fries and place them in the glass bowl. Have them on the bottom of the pan here and it should look like so. Now the next thing you're gonna do, or what, before you actually make the sweet potato fries, is you're gonna set your oven on around 425 degrees. And we're gonna place them in there for about, usually around 30 to 45 minutes, and just check on it, but I found an experience it usually takes about 40 minutes, depending on the level of crispiness you like. I like mine a little bit darker, a little more crispy. So you're probably gonna go the extent of at least 45 minutes in cooking the sweet potato fries. The sweet potato fries are now done and ready to serve. And so what you're gonna do is go ahead and just pull them out here. And we allow the, and we let these cook for about um, 45 minutes. And we're gonna pull them out now. And you can see, nice uh, crisp sweet potato fries. And so what you're gonna do is take them out and you're usually gonna lay them on a paper towel and allow some of the oil, some of the grapeseed oil there to soak out of them or coconut oil, whichever one you cooked with. We're gonna just place them on a, on a plate like so. And then what I like to do is take another paper towel and kind of pat over them too is another thing that you can do to kind of get some of it out, not totally necessary. And again, sweetie sweet potato fries, they're great for a kid's snack, they're great to pack for lunch in place of your regular uh, you know, McDonald's french fries or soggy fast food french fries. And again, very nutritious, tastes great, and you'll love them and uh, you know, let us know how you like them.